In this tutorial, I'm going to discuss arrays. Arrays are a list of a specific thing. So far, whenever we've created a variable, we've only stored one item in that variable. For example, num1 equals 10. What we've got is we've got the value 10 as an integer and it's stored inside num1. But what if we wanted to store multiple items inside one variable? So what we're going to do is we're going to create an array. To create an array, we must put the square brackets. I'm also going to update the name of my variable to num list. This isn't a necessary step, but I just like to keep things organized. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to populate this list with multiple numbers or integers. Each one of these items inside this array has an index value. The first item has an index value of zero. So what I'm going to do to reference the first item, I'm going to type in num list square brackets and put in a zero. To check this is working, I'm going to print this also. Now, as we can see, by printing off the first item of my list, it gives me an output of four. So this is allowing me to take data from the list. If I wanted to print off the last item, I would check what is the number or the index value of the last item. So if this is zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I'm going to type in eight and press play and I'm expecting 767 to be displayed. I hope you've enjoyed the tutorial.